Good evening and welcome to GB News Minute. I'm Andrew Wingrove and here are today's top stories. Sheikh Abdullah bin Zayed Al Nahyan, UAE Minister of Foreign Affairs and International Cooperation, said that the country reserves the right to respond to what it called terrorist attacks by Houthi militia in Abu Dhabi. The attacks on Monday targeted the international airport and petroleum tankers, killing three ADNOC employees and injuring six others. A statement by the UAE's foreign ministry added that those responsible for the targeting of its civilian facilities will be held accountable. In other news, Expo 2020 Dubai has recorded over 10.8 million physical visits as of January 18th and more than 65 million virtual visits. Some of the recent events that spurred visits include the first Global Goals Week to be held outside of New York and a K-pop concert too. Concluding on March 31st, it is the very first World Expo where every one of the 192 participating countries has its own pavilion. And finally, DP World has launched its new digital compliance and revenue platform Cargo's Customs. It enables paperless trade by deploying an AI-driven risk engine and smart valuation system. The platform, with a single window interface, further optimizes border management and aims to safeguard global supply lines. That's all for today. For all the latest news, do visit golfbusiness.com.